Hey guys, you can see our breath in this cabin tonight. It's a uh, winter snow storm in effect. We're expecting like a foot of snow. So we brought the old skidoo down. Chris has another skidoo here. So we're gonna get that fired up tomorrow. And uh, we got here tonight and it's like minus 10 Celsius in the cabin. You can see Chris lighting his fire back there. Oh, not really. Anyway, we made some turkey pot pie in the oven and that'll help warm up the cabin. And uh, pulled all the blankets back on the bed because it's frozen like a rock in there. But it shouldn't take too long with the wood heater to get it going. So, thanks for coming. Welcome back. beautiful today. It's calm and very, very quiet. Just the birds are chirping. There's no wind. There's no snow falling yet. That's supposed to change this afternoon, so it'll be nice to get some fresh snow. Try out the new plow truck. Over the summer, we left one of our skidoos down here. It's an older uh, machine that Chris has. And a bear totally mauled the seat. So that sucks because it was brand new. The seat was brand new. But Chris got him going today and we're going to get some supplies from the top and bring them down and probably fire up the plow truck and try that out on the road. Chris is just up top in the cabin with the pool table. We're gonna get it warmed up in there and we're gonna play some pool later. And I think it's gonna be a really awesome day. Well, we woke up this morning and it was minus 18 Celsius outside, but in the cabin it's, you know, like a balmy plus 23. <laughs> and it's really like the coziest thing you've ever experienced. If you've ever been outside where it's super cold and then you go inside where it's really warm, it's just like, oh, amazing. Looks like the lake finally froze over. Uh, I think it's a little late this year, but it's solid now. I'm gonna go check it out later. 
Let's see if I can walk on it. Hopefully that goes well. <laughs> Thanks for coming. If you like our video, please give us a thumbs up. And if you want to see some more cool cabin adventures or crazy things that Chris and Christy do, hit the subscribe button. We'd really appreciate it. Thanks.
I wonder where that guy's going. Somewhere warm. I love going for winter walks. The air is so crisp. The thing about winter is you can always dress up and be warm. I've been looking forward to this for a few months now. The views are so pretty when it's clear you can just see forever. Watch the airplanes fly by. See the little birdies. Awesome. Good? Well, we're at the lake. Chris is gonna be the brave one. Get a booter? <laughs> See if we can walk out there. Better than sinking a truck out there first, I guess. <laughs> eh? It's like a thing that we do here is like see who can sink their truck first. Not <laughs> like not us, but other idiots. <laughs> Yeah, some people do. <laughs> yeah, well, it's brave, you know. People might say the same thing about us after this video. <laughs> let's go find out. Okay, let's do it. Must be a feather or something. Maybe that's what he smelt. Some animal tracks? Yeah. What kind of animal is it? I think it's a fox. Is there ice under you? Like, if you there, there's snow under me. But like under that? Yeah, it's smooth. You could skate on it. Pretty smooth. Okay, I'm gonna go after you. You go, you can go first. Me first? Me, me after you? You before me. Oh. Hi, Ollie. any farther. It's only like this deep. It's only been froze for a day. A day? <laughs> Almost a week. It's not all the way froze.
don't jump. November 20th, we're out on the lake. Dog's out there too. It's spooky. <laughs> it's breezy. This there she is. Olive, come on. There she is. <laughs> Good girl. Look at you, snow dog. It's exciting to be on the lake. So many things we can do out here. We can go skiing, cross country skiing. We got some last year, so it's a lot harder than it looks. <laughs> and snowshoeing, we did that last year. Skidooing, ice fishing. It's really smooth this year, so if it stays that way, we might even be able to go skating. That'd be sweet. And last year in the spring, we plowed the most amazing, enormous airstrip right here. And we hosted a fly-in and there was 21 airplanes and a helicopter all parked right by our cabin entrance. That was very cool. So we're hoping that we can do that this year. So if Chris is super brave, he'll bring the plow truck out on the lake. That'd get her done fast. <laughs> yeah, it would. I'm excited. This is going to be cool. Why?
highlight is anyway. Knock the snow off? Yeah. I thought it would slide off there, but it's not. It's too heavy? So, we're wrapping up another cabin weekend. Chris is trying to take some ice off the roof because uh, the skylights got warm and then it melts and it ices and backs up. Last year we did a pretty major renovation on the cabin, the little cabin. And the roof was a very big part of that. So we weren't really sure how it was going to react, so it's all kind of new to us, but that'll be good to get that off there. We're going to Finish tidying up, load up the sleds, and head home. Thanks for coming.